It's Steve on the Guru Brew. I have a quick tip question for you. A customer recently asked me if they had a 64 or a 32-bit operating system. They wanted to install some software from the internet and that was one of the questions. What version do they download? That's pretty easy to figure out. Let's go to our computer and I'll show you how to find that information. I'm on a Windows 7 machine. If you go to the start menu and you go to your computer here and you use the right click button and go down to properties and left click it you can see the system type is listed under system and this one happens to be a 64-bit operating system yours may, may say 32-bit either way that is the current operating system so how do you know if you have a 32-bit system if you're capable of running 64-bit operating system and exactly what is 64-bit over 32 64-bit is the latest operating system and it uses system RAM more effectively and it can run faster basically than 32 but only if you have the 64-bit capable hardware to run the software. I'll show you how to uh, figure out if your machine's capable of running 64 if you only have 32. You can go to the Start menu, the Control Panel. In the Search Control Panel, type in Performance Information and Tools here, and then click on. Here it lists the performance in your ratings. If you click the view and print detailed performance and system information here, you can see that the system type is 64-bit operating system. If you were running a 32-bit, it would say 64-bit capable, and it would either say yes or no. If you're already running the 64-bit operating system, it won't show, but if you're not, it will say so here. So I hope that helped you. That was just a quick tip. Now you know if you have 32 or 64-bit. And if you have 32-bit, can you upgrade to 64? I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please leave us a thumbs up and a comment if you wish. If you have your own question that you would like answered, please head over to the gurubrewshow.com website, click on the Ask a Tech link, and leave a question, and maybe we'll answer it in an upcoming show. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.